Hey guys, I'm JD Ross. Today I'm going to teach you how to make control work if it's the Epic Games version installed from the Heroic Launcher. So by default, it might be set to Wine Ludris GE. It should work, but only on desktop mode. As you see, the game launches. We're gonna try launching it from Steam. This shortcut is made from Heroic Bash Launcher. It should launch because we are on desktop mode. See, it's working fine. You might think that's going to work on um, the gaming mode because it's working here, but it's not. It's not going to work at all. I'm not sure if it has anything to do with YNGE, but it just doesn't work. For the first scenario, let's say that you don't use Heroic Bash Launcher, which means you don't have this kind of shortcut where there's a complete banner. What you do is go to games, add a non-Steam game, browse, and then find wherever you installed the game. If you installed it on the default Heroic folder, it should be on Home Deck, Games, Heroic, Control. And then change this to All Files. And then click Control DX12.exe and then Open. Add selected programs. And then after adding it, go to Manage, Properties, Compatibility, Proton Experimental. And that's it. It should now work. If you have this kind of shortcut and you want to use it, it's simple. Just go to the file manager and then right click on Control DX12. Copy location. Go back. Go to the properties of the shortcut. And then change this. And paste. Now make sure that you have the codes here on the beginning and the end just to make sure that's gonna work and then go back here go back one folder right click on the control folder copy location go back to steam and then replace the start in just like that also make sure that you have the double quotes at the end and in the beginning and there we go let's try to launch it Make sure that it's also using Proton Experimental. And it launched. Now we're going to try it on the gaming mode. See if both shortcuts are working. We're gonna try the one with the bash launcher first. See if it works. See it's working fine. We're going to exit and try the other one. This is the one made without the Heroic Bash Launcher. It also works. But in my opinion, I think the one made with the Heroic Bash Launcher is better because it's complete. It even has the white banner here. And that's it. So thank you for watching. I hope I helped you guys. If you like this video, make sure to like and subscribe. Again, I'm JD Ross and see you on the next video.